guys and welcome to Phoenix and in Arms. Well here is an exciting package. It came from VZ's and if anybody's in Canada knows VZ sells seed, uh, excuse me, seeds and garden supplies and I ordered from them uh, last year and I think the year before if I remember. So they had such a good germination rate with their seeds that I ordered again and I'm doing this video in December 2020 and I ordered my seeds um, ASAP, basically as soon as I figured out what I was going to grow. Uh, this is just paper that I'll reuse. This is my, this is going to be my order form. And if you need to order seeds for 2021, don't wait guys. Uh, I would suggest you order right away. And they send, they always send you this little card, thank you for your order. And they write in who uh, packed it for you. So this was Tracy, which is funny because I think it was Tracy last time too for my other one. And here's our seeds. So we'll start with a really big pack. This is organic peas, golden sweet. So they're like uh, snow peas or snap peas or sweet peas, whatever you call them. Um, you can use them in stir fries, but instead of them being uh, green, they're supposed to be yellow. That's why they're called golden sweet. I never tried this variety before, so I'm going to try it this year. And this is a very big, heavy pack. Really big. Let's see what else I got. They have it all el elastic band together. So we have leeks. Uh, rat called Rally. The variety is Rally. I never did leeks before, but I want to try it because I want to make potato and leek soup. I never had that before either. So this is a standard pack of seeds, and this is the peas. So you can see, you can tell the size difference there. So leeks are going to be uh, exciting to plant for 2020. Uh, the next thing is celery tango variety I actually grew this last year and it grew I had a whole bunch and it was my first time growing celery last year so I'm going to try it again I got some melons called mini love and these are supposed to mature in 70 days I live in zone 5 about 5a 5b in Quebec Canada so we don't have the longest growing time at all so I found a variety that will mature pretty fast so I should get some this year these are onions long white Tokyo onions they're um, spring onions or bunching onions some you know they have a whole bunch of different names we call them shallots um, you know they're just known for different names but I bought these last year and I'm not kidding, every single seed I had from the package germinated. I had literally hundreds of these onions uh, and they grew over like a foot long, skinny. They tasted so good. I gave so much away. Uh, these are parsnips, Harris Model variety. I've never grown uh, parsnips from VZ's before. But I have tried them from other brands, like from the dollar store and stuff, and they did not grow at all very well. So I'm hopefully, uh, VZ's has a really good germination rate and reputation in Canada, so I'm going to give them a go for 2021. And then I got a Wild Garden Mix Kale. And I like this one because it's got a whole bunch of different mixes uh, all in one. And I really like kale for like baby kale when you put in sandwich, uh, sandwiches or salads. I like that. Now that's not all I'm growing for 2021. I have been saving uh, a ton of seeds. I would encourage you to look into saving seeds so you don't have to buy seeds every year. It, it comes out a lot cheaper. And don't wait to get your seeds guys. Please order your seeds as soon as possible. 